welcome back to It's Andretta. If you are new here, my name is Andretta and I talk all things pets. Today, we're gonna be discussing emotional support animals. So first off, raise your hand if you ever felt anxious or nervous. Yeah, we've all been there. Now I want you to imagine having a loyal companion by your side. And that loyal companion is offering comfort and support to you every day. That right there is the magic of having an emotional support animal. Now, like many people, you probably are wondering how is an ESA different than a service animal? And that's a good question. I want you to think about it like this. Service animals, they are trained to do a specific task. And on the other end, ESAs, they're all about offering emotional support just by being there for you when you need it most. Now, if you think to get an official ESA letter is gonna be hard, it's not, it's actually super easy. And I'm saying that because with Petable, the process is super simple. First, you're gonna start by taking an online assessment and it's really quick. And then from that online assessment, they're gonna connect you with a licensed therapist. And that therapist that they're gonna connect you with, they're gonna get you. They're gonna understand what you're going through. And from there, they can provide a valid ESA letter just for you. The cool thing about emotional support animals is that any dog breed can qualify. In this case, it's really more about what you need and not the breed. So whether you have a Labrador, a Poodle, or even a French Bulldog, they can all be a perfect companion. All right, so this is what I want you to do. Go and Google ESA letter, and you're gonna see Petable right at the top. Click that link, take the online assessment, and from there you're already taking your first steps to feeling better with the ESA by your side. I'm gonna place the link to Petable in the description box. I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye.